foundation glue, a blush pencil sharpener, EOS inside a globe, and lipstick in a pencil? Watch our new video to find out how to sneak your favorite makeup into class. Miss Smith is sick and tired of how chaotic her classes are. It's time to mind our P's and Q's. She shows the students all her favorite things. Toys, candies, makeup. According to our school rules, these are not allowed. No arguments. It's time to say goodbye. Dolly opens up her fitness bracelet eyeshadow while she still can. Trace a fitness tracker on thin cardboard. Cut out the base and cut out a little lid with flaps from clear plastic. Coat the bracelet with Vaseline. Insert the piece of cardboard. Put an applicator brush on the other side. Glue in an eyeshadow container and cover it with the plastic piece. Farewell, fitness eyeshadow. What a shame. And Christy applies her lapel pin lip gloss for the last time. Pour loose sparkly eyeshadow into a small decorative bottle. Cork it. Coat a small tube of lip gloss with glue and sprinkle glitter over it. Glue a pin back to small decorative pieces like these and attach the bottles and tubes to them. Parting with your favorite makeup product is such sweet sorrow. How am I supposed to get through class now? The girls decide to hide their makeup in their school supplies. Dolly snuck a nail file in with her sticky notes. Take sticky note tabs out of a pack. Trace a tab on a nail file. Trim it. Attach two files into the pack of sticky note tabs using double-sided tape. Open up the sticky note and secretly file your nail. How comfortable! I'm getting a manicure from my school supplies. Great idea! But your manicure won't be complete without some nail accessories. Christie's beautiful pen has a secret surprise. Hot glue a little jar with nail art decorations onto a pen with a decorative cap. Decorate it with rhinestones and cover the lid of the jar with a circle of fancy sticker paper. This jar of glitter can decorate your nails and also your pen. This idea is just as radiant as your school supplies, but Miss Smith doesn't appreciate the girl's inventiveness. She confiscates all their school supply makeup. Nobody's allowed to violate school rules. The students decide to play a prank. Let's swap out Miss Smith's supplies and see what happens next. Glue a small lipstick sample to a pencil. Cover the pencil with acrylic paint. Use another color to paint the lipstick. Cut a circle the diameter of the lipstick out of an eraser. Even out the edges with a nail file. Glue the eraser onto the cap of the lipstick. Dolly asks Miss Smith to loan her a pen and pencil. The teacher has no idea that there's lipstick hidden in her pencil. There it is, hiding under the eraser. Dolly lucked out. Christy opens up her brush. There's some contraband hidden in it, too. Remove the tip of a paintbrush and glue it to the tip of a lip crayon. Cover the rest of the lip crayon with acrylic paint. Both the girls color their lips with the lipstick they found. Regular school supplies transformed into makeup. Miss Smith is so angry that she's beside herself. You're not allowed to have makeup in class. But it's not our fault, Miss Smith. You gave this to us yourself from your own desk. And who even knows what the teacher's got hiding in her globe? I bet there's something interesting in there. Take a globe off its stand and cut it in half. Also pick out a styrofoam ball a little smaller than the globe and cut it in half too. Use the nozzle of a hot glue gun to make a groove in the styrofoam. Glue an EOS inside and glue on the second half of the sphere. Insert the sphere into the globe. Paint the top layer of the styrofoam with red acrylic paint. Make it look like the core of the earth. Put the globe back on its stand. Miss Smith looks into the depths of the planet. No way! What a cute EOS! The teacher happily applies the bomb to her lips. Wow! Way to go, Miss Smith! You're breaking your own rules! 
The sound of the bell means it's time for our lunch break. Miss Smith is determined to protect her school rules. Get ready for a makeup war. Let's get out our glittery palette lunchbox. Color the lid of a lunchbox with acrylic paint. Glue glitter eyeshadow to the inside of the lid. Close the lunchbox. Attach a cute felt decoration on top. The girls put on their war paint. A glitter battle is about to start. To freedom, to equality, to beauty. We'll never give up our makeup. Miss Smith won't surrender either. All's fair in love and war. She'll make herself look more battle ready using Play-Doh. Transfer hair gel into a cleaned out Play-Doh container. Miss Smith takes styling gel out of Play-Doh cups. Now her smooth hair will lead her to victory. She's a fearless fighter in the war on makeup. Plus, she's got a secret weapon, comb pens. Take a ballpoint pen apart. Coat it with acrylic paint. Break the metal handle off of a comb. Heat it over a candle and insert it into the pen cap. Paint the comb the same color you painted the pen and attach it to the pen. Miss Smith combed out her thoughts. Now she's ready for whatever her students have in store for her. Suddenly, Miss Smith gets a message. It's a sweet text from the PE teacher. Finally, he scored a goal in Miss Smith's heart. How cute! Miss Smith's a person too, not just a robotic teacher. Miss Smith is so happy that she started blushing. My goodness! I should tone my face with some glue and a sponge. Thoroughly clean out a bottle of Elmer's glue. Pour foundation inside. The teacher squeezes foundation onto a paint sponge. Cut up a beauty blender. Trim off part of a wooden stick and attach the blender to it. The teacher sneakily fixes up her face with foundation glue. But the girls see everything she's doing. That's unfair! The students can't do their makeup in class, but the teacher can? Miss Smith quickly hides the evidence. Nice try, Miss Smith. Your foundation glue won't be able to seal the cracks of your students' broken trust. Christy brought a whole collection of highlighters into class with her. Hey, Dolly! Try this out! Dolly reluctantly takes the unusual highlighter, but there's actually eyeliner inside. Take apart an old highlighter. Put eyeliner into the main part. Use tweezers to remove the rod. Trim the plastic tip of the highlighter with a hot knife. Remove the cap from the eyeliner. Put the trim tip into the highlighter. Cut the cap of the eyeliner with a hot utility knife. Remove the brush and glue it inside the marker cap. Close the eyeliner. What a surprise! Dolly's a big fan of this highlighter. She can draw an eyeliner right in the middle of class. The rest of Christie's highlighters aren't normal either. Let's see what we've got. One is hiding makeup brushes. Take the rod out of an old dried up highlighter. Trim makeup brushes. Coat the handles with acrylic paint and insert them into the marker. The girls get out their brushes. A highlighter is a great case for a brush. Let's do our eyebrows in secret. Doing algebra got them all mixed up. And what's hiding in the second marker? Tiny perfume. Take a highlighter apart. Cut up the rod. Put one part back in. Put a perfume sample inside. Close the cap. The girls spray themselves with highlighter perfume. Now they'll make the whole room smell like math and sitting in class got a lot better. The students are breaking the rules again. This time around, they've got glue and a pencil sharpener with them. Not plain ones though, but ones with makeup inside. Pour foundation into a clean tube of liquid glue. Wipe off the opening of the tube. Cut a circle out of a makeup sponge and put it into the tube instead of a dispenser. Christy applies foundation straight from a glue pen. And Dolly gets out her pencil sharpener blush. Cut a wide cocktail straw. 
glue it to the body of a pencil sharpener. Coat the sharpener and the straw with acrylic paint. Fill the container with blush pearls. Put a small makeup brush into the straw. The girls have made a beautiful mess, and they made Miss Smith cry. Why does no one ever listen to her? She's not just a blank space behind a desk. The girls feel bad. They give their favorite teacher all their makeup. Here, cover up your tears and brighten up your educational face. Fine, fine, I forgive you. Let's declare a truce. After enforcing all the rules, day-to-day -day school life feels so boring and regular. Miss Smith finally understands how her students feel and decides to reward them with makeup for their good behavior. Sprinkle food glitter into a clean tube from glitter glue and pour in lip tint. Tightly close the lid. Turns out that this glitter glue is actually lip tint. Don't get confused, girls. Miss Smith took pity on you and gave up on her strict rules. Let's tint our lips without any fear and get good grades too. Did you like our school life hacks? Then let us know in the comments about how you plan to sneak your favorite makeup into school. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss new makeup ideas from Troom Troom.